In this video, I'd like to try to illustrate for you some of the differences between the soft, soft B, and the scratch brush. In general, the soft brush should be used when the mesh is a lot lower resolution and you're building up the basic forms in your mesh. Soft B and scratch should be used when the mesh is a lot denser and you're creating more fine lines and finer details and with a brush that has a lot smaller diameter. The soft, the soft brush, you can use a brush with a lot larger diameter on fewer polygons. So let me show you some of the differences here. The soft brush can actually brush on the surface. It's great for doing these larger forms, um, but when I make the brush much smaller, it's very sensitive to the velocity of your stroke or how fast you're actually pulling that brush stroke. So if you see if I actually drag like this, I can actually get a series of dots that are in the mesh. Now this mesh is actually quite dense, so this is not a good time to really uh, use the soft brush for creating these finer details. I'm not saying you shouldn't do that, shouldn't use a soft brush, but um, because there are a lot of you know smaller strokes and things like that that you may be doing that the soft soft brush will be fine for using. But uh, we have the soft B brush here, uh, and let's just illustrate the difference. If I if I go really really slow with this tool and then I change my speed, it doesn't matter. My stroke is actually still very, very, very crisp and sharp, and I can actually get a nice a nice line in the surface. I want to cut the mesh like that, I can actually do that very, very easily with this tool. So the soft B brush is not as sensitive to velocity changes, and it will give you a nice, crisp, smooth stroke, but it's not the best for building up your larger forms, for example, the, you know this muscle here this entire muscle here or this entire muscle here um, it's really to be used when you're actually at a very close um, very fine level of detailing in the mesh the scratch brush is actually named because of what it's very good at doing which is just really cutting through the mesh at a very very ha fast speed um, you can literally slice right through it like it, the mesh is butter or something like that and uh, it is, is best really used for very, very crisp, geometric uh, details, um, very sharp, scratch-like forms. And so, hence we've given it that sort of a name because we don't, really don't know uh, any better way of calling it, really. Um, but it's just note that each one of those three brushes do have different brushing algorithms, and they were designed uh, um, in our sculpting, based on our sculpting work workflows, um, to accomplish different tasks. Sculpt soft brush is used for larger forms on fewer polygons, and the soft B and scratch brush are used on more dense meshes with a smaller brush diameter.